Hello friends and how are you all doing today? The question says construct an isosceles triangle whose base is 8 cm and altitude 4 cm. And then another triangle whose sides are 1.5 times the corresponding sides of the isosceles triangle. So, the steps of constructions will be the first step is to draw a triangle that is an isosceles triangle whose base is 8 cm and altitude 4 cm. So this is an isosceles triangle where AB is equal to AC altitude. Let's say this as AD as 4 cm and we have BC as 8 cm. Right. Now we need to construct another triangle whose sides are one and a half times one and a half times the corresponding sides of the isosceles triangle. So the second step is to draw any vertex or sorry any ray bx making an acute angle with bc so we have With BC, array AX, sorry, array BX, which is opposite to the vertex A, right? And this is an iso, uh, this is an acute angle. Now, the third step is to locate three points because one and a half means 3 by 2 and the greater of 3, 3 and 2 in 3 by 2 is 3. So we will locate 3 points B1, B2 and B3 on Bx such that BB1 is equal to B1, B2 is equal to B2, B3. Now, so here we have BB1 equal to B1, B2 equal to B2, B3 on line B on sorry on ray BX. Now what we need to do is we need to join B2 to C. Let me write it down also. Now the fourth step is to join. B2 that is the second point as 3 is sorry as 2 is smaller in 3 by 2 right so we will join B2 to C and draw a line through B Three parallel to B to C intersecting the extended line segment BC at C dash. Okay. So let us join B2 to C first and now we will extend BC and we need to now draw a line parallel through B3 intersecting the extended BC at C dash. 
this is with the help of the compass now the fifth step is now to draw a line through c dash parallel to ca intersecting the extended line segment ba at a dash so let us first extend the line ba and now we need to draw a line which is parallel to ac through c dash intersecting the extended ba at a dash right so a dash b c dash is the required triangle right now for justification We know that triangle ABC is similar to triangle A dash B C dash that we have constructed. So this implies that AB upon A dash B is equal to AC upon A dash C dash is equal to BC upon B C dash, isn't it? But we also know that BC upon BC dash is equal to BB2 upon BB3 which is equal to 2 by 3 or we can say that BC dash upon BC taking its reciprocal is equal to the reciprocal of 2 by 3 that is 3 by 2. And therefore we can write that A dash B upon AB is equal to A dash C dash upon AC is equal to BC dash upon BC is equal to 3 by 2. So this is the required justification for our construction. Hope you understood the whole process well. Do Make your diagram neatly and hope to see you next. Bye for now.